Hello everyone, welcome to the Bug Expert channel. In this video, we will talk about solutions for friends who encounter Nikkei Mobile failed to initialize user information error. This error usually indicates that we are encountering a server-side problem. Of course, we may encounter such an error not only because of this problem, but also due to many problems. For this, we will try to solve the problem by telling you a few suggestions. Before we show you solutions, we will briefly talk about the forum. You can forward various errors you encounter to the community on the forum portal we have opened. For this, if your problem continues or if you encounter a different problem, you can get a quick response by sharing it on the forum portal. We care about your questions and suggestions. Maintenance work on Goddess of Victory Nikkei servers may cause you to encounter various connection errors like this. For this, you can observe the cause of the problem by following the official Goddess of Victory Nikkei Twitter platform. You can reach the official Twitter page by clicking the link in the article. An unstable network connection problem on your internet can cause you to encounter various errors like this. For this, you can eliminate the problem by renewing or changing your internet. If you are connecting via Wi-Fi, try connecting to the internet via mobile data. If you are connecting via mobile data, try connecting to the internet via Wi-Fi. If none of these actions are the solution for you, restart your modem and connect to the Wi-Fi network and check if the problem persists. The Nikkei mobile app is out of date, meaning it's not open to innovations. Therefore, we need to verify whether the Nikkei mobile app is up to date. Otherwise, we may encounter more than one error or problem and get an access block. Any cache problem in the Nikkei mobile application can cause us to encounter such errors. For this, we can eliminate the problem by clearing the data and cache. First of all, let's open the settings menu and open the applications menu. Let's select the Nikkei game on the screen that opens and touch the storage option. Let's clear the cache data by clicking the clear data option on the screen that opens. After the cleaning process is complete, you can check if the issue still persists. If you do not think that there is any maintenance work or crash on the server, uninstalling and reinstalling the game may solve the problem. Deleting and reinstalling the app can help prevent various errors like this. This may be due to the application files being corrupt or faulty. For this, completely delete the Nikkei mobile application from your device, download it again, perform the installation process and open it. After this procedure, you can check if the problem still persists. Yes, in this video we have provided information on how to fix Nikkei mobile failed to initialize user information error. If you are encountering various errors, you can reach the community with your questions by accessing the forum portal we have opened. By supporting us, we can expand our community. Thank you.